My name is Rebecca Fiebrink, and I'm a lecturer here at Goldsmiths. I do research and I teach in a variety of domains related to both computing and music and other types of creative practice. I think something like Mojis, where you can, you can play with different objects in the real world, allows you this really exciting hybrid of the power of digital technology and the power of analog technology. Obviously, you know, digital technology is great for making music because you can make hypothetically any imaginable sound using digital audio. But if you look at mice and keyboards and even mixing desks, these are very limiting interfaces. Whereas in the physical world, you have every single object you look at has what we would say different affordances, right? There's different ways you can interact with it as a person. You can hit it, you can kick it, you can scratch it, you can sit on it. But it can be much more than that. You're getting interesting data and data that reflects the physical properties of the world, reflects the ways that people are interacting with that world. Um, and you can imagine all sorts of interactive possibilities that that opens up. So I get really excited um, anytime someone with a really promising, interesting piece of technology starts to open it up. I'm really looking forward to seeing Mojis come out with something that's more affordable, that's more flexible. I think that uh, I'm looking forward to seeing what it is that people are going to start making with it because I expect that it won't be the things that I, I've thought of and it won't be the things that my coworkers have thought of, but you know, when a 10-year-old kid can have one of these and start making the things that he or she thinks are fun, uh, that's when it gets really exciting.